Hi guys, it's Tisha in Japan and I'm here today um, to share my Studio Calico kit with you. Um, I got the sock hop one and I also got the penny loafers add-on and the poodle skirt. Now, I might have gotten in over my head and I don't even know if I can do that many layouts, but I really liked the kits. Um, since I joined, my priorities have kind of changed and I'm rethinking whether I want to be part of the club. I enjoy it, I just don't know if I can do it or maybe I should just get one, the main kit, and then see how that goes. But um, I wanted to order the new, um, the, the one add-on for the new kit of the month and um, I decided just to get the main kit and then I'll see how that goes and if I don't get to use it much then I will you know um, maybe put my membership on hold and then rethink it but I do have a lot of scrappy goodies to keep me occupied I just have other things that I need to do but anyways let's get right to the thing so these are the extra papers that I ordered I'll just share them first because I thought they were really fun and might be useful for winter or for um, Christmas this one is um, the yearbook tardy paper that's a nice one there there's another green superlatives yearbook paper I like this one I really love this green one and this was the same one that um, Bonnie got mittens I like the stitching on the back too so that might be nice to cut I really like the just the plain green for snowflakes though and this one is really cute with the houses and the pine trees and this is called ice caps from the wonderland and I liked the orange this is the darling deer um, Flynn paper and it has this weird um, shape <laughs> I don't know why weird but yeah and then I ordered um, this darling deer um, pieces what's the alpha pieces I guess the stickers because I liked them um, I thought they were a little bit more orangey they're kind of like um, a vermilion but I like some of these things here, and I I thought that was neat. I don't really have anything in that color, so that is those are the papers I got. Now I'm going to, sorry, I'll leave this here just so I know where my camera is. So the first um, one I'll share with you is the Poodle Skirt, and I got some of these awesome ones. They're really cool, chip, thick chip pieces. The Pink Paisley Portfolio Alpha Stickers, which are super shiny. The Dear Lizzie die cuts and they look really nice. I like those foxes are super cute. They remind me of the um, Prima ones that they had and I really like the stamp set. Find joy shine on. Do what you love. And um, then I got these ones. I love these. I used a ton of those in my last one. These are from the Soleil collection and they're the tape strips from basic gray and I thought they were really fun I don't know how I'll use them but I'll try and these are the snow cone snow spelt s-n-o hyphen cone and then they're really cute pink and white and then I don't have um, any of these papers so this is from the midway collection I was excited to get this but this is a really cool yellow on the back too so I might have to cut that one up. I really love this pink. That would make a nice background. And look at that nice piece on the bottom. You could even um, cut the top off and keep that as part of your, if you were going to use that to if it. I'm not actually keen on this. Um, I don't like the colors of this chevron to be honest. It's not my thing. It's from the fifth and frolic. I really like the pink though. And then there's this yellow piece. And look at that awesome bottom strip. It's got a typewriter and it says a good laugh is sunshine in the home with arrows going to it. That's awesome. But on the back, it, it um, has this awesome one here too. So that's going to be hard to um, decide. But at least I can keep the back. Maybe if I don't use the yellow triangles, I kind of like that. But maybe I can like um, use those triangle wood veneers and then like do them yellow and then add them here anyways. And it'll get like similar effect. This is the Soho Garden. Um, this paper is from Fifth and Frolic too. This one is um, Grammarie Park by American Crafts. And um, the back is the feathers, so that's kind of cool. 
Vivid 05 project by I'm not sure I don't know what that is but that's kind of neat like um, color thing going on I picture the bubble wrap um, I love how um, Christina CA Vets YouTube user does her um, bubble wrap and painting oh and I super love these back cards they're awesome this is from the fifth and frolic collection too and it's got these awesome arrows and then these birds in the background so that is the one kit the next kit um, oh actually I'm gonna keep the main kit I'll do the penny loafers now just because I thought you guys haven't seen the add-ons this is the photo tabs and I thought there was actually only eight in here and they were metal but they look like paper and they have a ton of different things on them so that was nice um, a nice change and these ones are cool they're by crate paper um the acorn avenue which i super loved but i love how they're like all sewn together so i don't have to sew them because i think it's a bit hard to get my thing out and you know it's a hassle and i'm not that great at it but i love this they're awesome and then these letters are super cool they're by pebbles just look at that beautiful teal and then these are the phrase stickers by Acorn Avenue and look at gorgeous and um, I'll do the papers in just a second I haven't even opened it because I'm waiting to share it with you guys I'm totally ripping this envelope so sad oh oh so all of these sequins are like coming out there's all these like sequins and I loved I know you can buy sequins guys but I find it really awesome that they give you sequins and then they have all these buttons up I think they're like a half a pack and I'm not sure which collection collection if they're from the midway or I think they're from midway but I could be wrong if they're from some other place and then there's this L studio love this life love this life little tag right here and I guess you cut it so that's cool and then this was the stamp set and look at that's cool I don't own well I do have one I don't own a stamp with my sets actually I like this like you're here and the big big ad that'd be fun to play with and then as for the papers I was so loving the papers the scene and noted, noted and has the days of the week written but look at this hard stuff and it has this awesome chevron on the bottom this is a super cool one and I'm seeing it go with this one right here but this is the soap from the Soleil collection it's like this but look at the hearts on the back I love that and then this is a fifth and frolic simplicity circle and it has this gray circles and then this teal on the back and then this is like kind of like washi strips and it's from the acorn avenue it's kind of neat and then it has this brown stripe roughed on the back so that is the penny loafers kit I want to have these sequins everywhere so I just try to get them up for now I'm just gonna keep this all together when I store it that's fine because I'm gonna use it as I need to so for the last kit here I have that acorn acorn no <laughs> that arrow washi tape the feather wood veneers Jenny Bolin studio alphas and I like how they have these starburst ones in the bottom. They're cool. These are like the vellum strips but from the, what's that, fact and fiction, fact or fiction one. And then these special chipboard letters, which are so cool. I love the navy color of them. And I will open this one to share the thingies. I hope my battery, my camera doesn't die. So there's happy. And these are super flat. I like them. And there's this random boy. And then there's some fun little um, ones here. I like the smile and a heart. And I'm thinking about doing um, the challenge. I'm not thinking. I need to do Bonnie's challenge. I want to share to get going on that because I only have a day maybe or a couple left. I really like this arrow stamp. That's super cute. And this is two story. And then there's like these brads in here that I'm not going to take out and then as for the papers um, I'm excited there's some pink ones and then this cool like round circle one this flower one 
And then that, you guys have probably seen these, I'm not going through. That cool vellum with the, with the feathers. I really, really like the color of this um, wood pattern. And then this is just um, a ledger sheet. I super love this Lucille paper and the dark too. I wish I had two of those. I like this one and I love the brown in the back. But this one, the brown and pink chevron is so cool. That's a neat square. See, I'm so in love with this. This is from, this is basically for Studio Calico. I love that. It looks like their PB&J um, one that I'm using for my lobster. I love the numbers. And then I have this um, dotted white piece of paper and um, a craft sheet, a gray sheet, and then this really neat teal color. So I'm so excited. That is my Studio Calico. And I'm just um, warming up here. I wanted to show you, look, I got this cool mat. It's Christmassy. And um, we went shopping yesterday, so I will be getting a Kotatsu. That will be coming um, on Friday. So our house is very warm now and I'm going to decorate the Christmas tree and try and get Bonnie's challenge done so I can participate because she's awesome. <laughs> Alright guys, take care. Bye.